My name's Edwina Jans and I'm the Head of Heritage, Exhibitions and Engagement here at the Museum of Australian Democracy. It's one of the newest kids on the block of the National Collecting and Cultural Institutions. We were formed in 2009 and of course we have our home here in the magnificent Old Parliament House building. Since then we've been exhibiting and telling the stories more broadly of Australia's democracy, its past, present and more importantly its future. It's a nationally listed heritage site, so it's of importance to the whole of Australia as being the first purpose-built federal parliament building, opened in 1927 by the Duke and Duchess of York. Arriving here at Old Parliament House is a momentous occasion in and of itself because you will be walking up the front steps into this parliamentary building and then you come into the museum and you're right inside the object. So Old Parliament House is the biggest and most precious object in the Museum of Australian Democracy's collection and you're stepping right inside that. And so you have the opportunity to have an authentic heritage experience in the chambers and in King's Hall. So in 2017 we're celebrating the 90th anniversary of Old Parliament House and we're really taking the opportunity to not only explore its history through exhibitions and activities but some of those activities have been actively asking people what might it be like in a hundred years time and what sort of democracy would you like to see? What are the values that you hold dear and how might we work together to explore those? Our content is bold. We take very seriously our remit to engage people's voices and the spirit of democracy. So all of our exhibitions have that opportunity for people to comment back to us so that we're actively having that conversation with visitors both here and afar. A visit here to the museum includes contemporary exhibitions that explore different sorts of ideas, but importantly also a visit to the two chambers, to King's Hall. There is that opportunity literally to sit in the seats where those decision makers sat. We welcome hundreds of thousands of visitors here every year, including 80,000 students and teachers. And we see that as a really important way of engaging with citizens of today and tomorrow. And we engage with our visitors in a multitude of ways. We have a very active civics and citizenship education program, which is run formally through the schools, which is both a digital and, a, and an authentic heritage experience. The Australian Government is really committed to preserving, communicating and collecting Australia's arts and culture and that's really important to us as we are tasked with preserving Old Parliament House, this magnificent national icon and telling its stories, but also that opportunity for us to engage with visitors in exhibitions and public programs and telling that story, making Australians feel proud of of their um, arts and culture and their history and asking them to engage with um, its future and the future of their own democracy.